Okay, so for homework review, I want to go over your answers here. Um, so theta is a symbol that just refers to an angle. Uh, if I had letters on the angles, like if I said this is triangle ABC, I could also call it angle A. So that little symbol in there is a Greek letter which refers to that angle. They want us to label each side of this. So um, the hypotenuse is always across from the 90 degree angle. Now opposite and adjacent are in relation to this angle that's given. So since the angle is down here on the lower left, the side opposite the given angle or the reference angle is what we'll call it. Uh, that side is opposite. So we'll put an O there. And then the one sort of right next to the reference angle, the side that's right next to it, that's called adjacent. Please note that the hypotenuse is also right next to or adjacent to the reference angle. Those are both adjacent. But this one already has a name. It's always the hypotenuse across the 90 degree angle. So I just want to keep in mind and show you that both of these sides are considered adjacent to the reference angle theta. Um, but the hypotenuse already has a name. So let's move on to the next one. If this is my reference angle, theta, then um, the one opposite my reference angle is always opposite. Now there's two, as I just mentioned, there's two that are sort of adjacent, two sides, right? This side and this side. They're both like right next to the reference angle. So which one's adjacent and which one's well, the hypotenuse? Well, this one already has the name hypotenuse because that's across from the 90. So then this other one must be the adjacent. That's the one next to my reference angle. If theta is my reference angle, we've got across from it is opposite. We know across from the 90 is, is always the hypotenuse. And the other one that's right next to my reference angle is adjacent. Here's my reference angle. Across from the 90 is always the hypotenuse. Across from the reference angle is opposite. So that's a opposite the angle. And then right next to it is adjacent. Uh, now they want us to set up the trig ratio for each of the following triangles. So this one is our reference angle. Across from the 90 is always hypotenuse. Across from the reference angle is always opposite. And then the one next to the reference angle is adjacent. So, um, which two sides are the ones they give us? Adjacent and hypotenuse. So which one of our trig ratios from the video is adjacent over hypotenuse? You can use the Sokotoa sine equals opposite over hypotenuse. Cosine equals adjacent over hypotenuse. And tangent equals uh, opposite over adjacent. I should probably write out the, the uh, shortcut. Sine is spelled S-I-N-E, but we abbreviate S-I-N. Cosine is spelled K-O-S-I-N-E, but we use C-O-S as an abbreviation. And tangent is T-A-N-G-E-N-T, uh, but we use the the um, short the the shorthand T-A-N. So now we also need our angle in there. I forgot to write that in there. Uh, so they've already written the angle here for us, so I don't need to write that. So which one's adjacent over hypotenuse? That's cosine. All right, let's move on. This one, here's my reference angle. Across from my reference angle is opposite. Across from my hypotenuse is, uh, across from my 90 degrees is my hypotenuse. So they want us to write the ratio opposite over hypotenuse. When I look back up again here, that's sine of theta. So that's what they want us to write in there. Um, so here's my hypotenuse. Here's my reference angle. Across from that is opposite. So they want us to use the opposite over hypotenuse ratio. And that one, again, is sine. Um, here is my 90 degree angle. Across from that is hypotenuse. They don't tell us that one, so that's not the one we're using. Here's my reference angle. Across from that is opposite. 
next to it is adjacent. So they want us to use opposite over adjacent. That one is tangent. So I'm going to write tan. And that's what you need to be able to do. This uh, we're not going to talk about right now. Uh, now you're going to move on to the next thing you're doing today. I will show you a video to do the first couple.